Um, Leo's coming to DR next week, and Jenny, Jenny's working, so she can't travel right now, but introduce yourself. I'm Jenny, the prettier sister. Definitely not. Yeesh. I'm Chris, I'm Jenny's boyfriend. And guys, today we're going to be doing a mukbang Dominican version. So we're in the Dominican Republic right now, and we're going to be trying the snacks from here. So it's basically like a snack crepe. So we're going to try sure. all of this for the first time. I heard that this is the Gatorade, I mean power read. It's just not even full. They be playing people out here. They are finessers here. Guys, the lighting ain't good because you already know we got no equipment, but we're trying to do the best we can here. Yeah. And a lot of the stuff here is also, like, they have a lot of American snacks, so it's just kind of hard for us to find. So, yeah. let's get started. I want to try this first. For real? What do you want to start off with? Uh, I want to try the Cheetos since it's American. I want to see if there's a difference. You got a drink chip? You got this like is candy? a lot sweeter. I'll probably try a candy. Let me try this. You know what this is? It's quarter juice. These are gold. I feel like these are worms, so I feel like you can't really mess up worms. Tell me not. Try this. The power rate tastes like quarter half juice. Half power rate, half quarter juice, yeah. Who's cool. cold? Okay, so the Cheetos, quarter juice. Smell the same. Oh, well, they smell a little different. You guys are going to hear all the background music, so don't mind. You good? Mmm. They smell? The Cheetos from Sierra are a lot better than the Cheetos from America. Mm -hmm. The extra orange. I mean, they they kind of look the same, but not really at the same time. Oh, they dim, dim my orange. Look inside. They're really good. You see? Oh, shit. They taste like the Price Right chips, the cheap ones. The cheap right balls. Right. They're not as crunchy and that's hard. They're like a lot softer. They're good. And it's funny because all the nutrition, obviously, but all the nutritional facts and all the stuff, as in Spanish, so that's what we can do. Eso y más que eso. <laughs> I like that. I'm gonna try one right now. I'm gonna try everything extra sour. No, but this might be a. Let me see. Oh, sure. This might be a little sour. I got the sour queen, so we'll do it. They're really good. They're very good. They're straight. They, there's not much of a difference. I get the bootleg version all the time in Rhode Island, so. Yeah. I got some to their lives. I feel like these are a lot sweeter than the ones in the United They're States. not bad though. They're yeah, good. they're a little bit more sweeter than some Caramelos de goma. What? Caramelo de goma. That's a long ass name. I thought caramelos was caramel. Caramel. Alright. So, broke caramel. How have you guys liked the yard so far? It's cool. I just wish they didn't like. Try to milk us everywhere we went. They milked like, the shit out of us. This is the most milkiest <laughs> country of them all. <laughs> I, and, and I'm Dominican, so it's not to talk shit, but yo, like, I get that everyone struggles and all that stuff, but yo, we're not rich in the United States either, and we struggle too. And they want to milk you like some guy yesterday, just to call us a cab, he wanted money. Like, bro, bro there's like no favors over here. That doesn't exist over here. It's like, oh wow, he's trying to spot us because we're not from here. Thank God, Jesus. And he's like, well, I can't wait to see my tip. That's what he said. Yeah. Like, Damn. Not like, only that, but they ask you for a tip. They don't even be like, like out of common courtesy. Like, now nah. they be like, oh, hell no. And like, they wait for their tip. They'll yeah, and they follow way. you. And the same shit with the bill. They be like, like right there, they just be like, this hover, like, what are you going to pay me? Like, Where's the bro? Back the hell up. I'm going to pay you, obviously. Should be mad. I'm just trying this gator. You think this gator is gonna try be the same? Try it, try it, try These bottles are fishy. They might like flimsy. I feel like it's sometimes I feel like they like refill it and like seal it again. No, for real though, because <laughs> this shit wasn't even full. So it's a, it's pretty weird. Let's see, let's see what this gator This, me, me and Abby were dying because, God, yeah, tell them This better, this is, it's called Vive, Vive 100% Cherry Fresa. But what, okay. tell them what this. And then here para tu día. So it's energy for your day. So it's like a Red Bull. 
couple of weeks. And I can't. I'm ca- I'm caffeine sensitive, so I'll be I'll be afraid from that. Book. How's, how's the Gatorade? How's the Gatorade? It's a lot sweeter. Seems like rice. a lot of things here are a lot sweeter. I'm only gonna have like, like I guess they use like pure cane sugar in their drinks. I'm only honestly. gonna have like literally a baby shot of this because then my heart's gonna stop pumping. Ooh. It's already pumping. I'll try it. I'll take the I'll take one for the team. Oh my god. Yeah, it's time to listen sugar. to that guy. No, for real. For I'm real, I should never listen to a freaking cotton bowl. Whoa, the Gatorade definitely don't taste the same because I don't like Gatorade and I actually No, I drink Gatorade often, so we're gonna I'm gonna be the judge. I actually Ooh. hate Gatorade, but this energy drink tastes pretty straight. What it's the so hell? Gatorade. This is not this is not Gatorade. That's it's a lot of, sweeter. Yeah, well, no, it's it is more, nothing like Gatorade. The Powerade and the Gatorade is almost swims. For real, this tastes nothing. I gotta bring some home for Jenny and Leo to try. I'm excited to try the Mofongo snacks. I've had this on the bus here, which. Another thing. Oh, transportation here is have a story terrible. <laughs> Guys, we went through the struggle. So you first, the struggle. so first week we were in the resort. Okay, cool. We're chilling. We're we're feeling real nice and rich at the resort. Then it's time to go. Our moms basically said, um, "Oh yeah, don't worry about it." Before we came, well, we'll figure it out. We'll have this. We'll have that. We'll tell a cousin. We'll tell this one. All right, cool. So we're thinking everything Gucci. All right, first things first. We gotta take like a Peter Pan bus. So we're like, fuck it, that's what we gotta do. I was good, because I am not the one. I, I haven't took a freaking public bus in so we long. We had mad There's nothing wrong with them. No, we had a lot of luggages on us. That was the main problem. And I'm an overpacker, so. We had a lot of stuff with us, and there was six of us in total. We have a guest company? I don't know. Sorry, guys. But anyways. Okay, yeah. We yeah, had um, Those are smacking. We're gonna touch me. Here. We had mad um stuff with us, but whatever, that's besides the point. Then the bus driver tells us we have to get off on a certain stop. But they say that every single stop you go on, they'll yell out like, where they're stopping. Like for example, if it's Blue Street, good, right? they'll be like, "Blue Street coming right up." Blah blah blah. Okay. This dumbass bus driver never told us that they had already called. Out. Well, they said that they had already called out the street, but they never called out the street. Mind you, we told them what street we were going to. So they leave us in the middle of the trenches, the hood, the crazy, where all these luggages, people can spot out from miles and miles away that we're Americans. Yeah, and it's not like, DR is not like, not every spot is bad in DR. That right there is a motorcycle. It's like a motorcycle. It's like a motorcycle. So, it's not that every spot in DR is bad, but there's spots that you, not even cops go in. So we don't know where the hell we're at. We're over here with mad maletas and luggages, mad stuff. In the middle of nowhere, where everyone trying to like just staring at us, like looking like they're ready to fucking kill us. Yeah, they were grilling us, and we had to huddle together like, like coins. Shit, I was meeting mother them right back, bro. Yeah. I can't. Have to. That was so, horrible. Never again. Then it took us like thirty minutes to find a cab because there were six of us with hundred luggages. Yeah, and that's when the guy was like, "Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna call you the cab," but we're thinking like, "Damn, this guy feels bad for us because he sees us with all our stuff." Mm-hmm. Yeah, right. He just wanted <laughs> money. Like always, everything's about money. Guys, it's so crazy here that there was a guy that passed by with a with a weight. Was it? Is it called a, no a scale? A scale, weight with a scale. scale. <laughs> trying to <laughs> charge us for us to to to, to so weigh ourselves. Yeah. He was Just walking around with a house scale, like <laughs> like what? I'm like. That's what? one thing I tell. I tell like people out here. They're like hustlers. They like they make it happen. However, well, they have to make it happen. But yo, how you gonna walk around with a scale that I don't even know if it's calibrated or not? <laughs> And you're gonna charge me to step on that scale. Yeah, also is right. And there. They, we're American, so then guys, I did my nails, I just cut I just cut myself off. I did my nails supposed to be three hundred Dominican dollars, which is how much? Hold this. Which well, is how much? Fifty is, is one. So three hundred supposed to be five dollars. <laughs> and they charged me one thousand dollars, which is twenty dollars. And they did them terrible, they're coming off. I did them like three days ago. So the moment that they know that you're not from that you're from the States is a wrap. Yeah, I call the prices. I'm using the box. Money, 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 money. Like for real, today I took out. Today I took out eighty dollars, like eighty American dollars. I don't even know how much I have left. And yeah, like it may seem like one dollar is fifty pesos here, but like, things, things, things are expensive here. And not only that, then there's family members that try to move you too. Oh, they be the worst ones. Those are the worst ones. And they get offended and mad if you don't pay for them. So Randy, not even a, a yeah, I'm watching this video. You was right, bro. <laughs> You're supposed to bring a good amount of money here. But I'm ready to try some new. Something new. Everybody grab something. 
I have some black pastries. Let's try these cookies. I kind of want to add a little salty in this sweet. This but you're going to do all the chips and stuff? Right? Well, these are nuts. You said it was donuts. Nuts. Double nuts. Double. <laughs> donuts. <laughs> donuts and double nuts. Wait, she said this was donuts. And I'm like, like, and I'm like, like damn, these are some hard donuts in the supermarket. Oh. But you know what's funny? She didn't stop and read the bag either. She was like, oh, all right, I donuts. thought it was donuts. And I looked her at the bag. Let's see. Well, these the are like, uh, Caribbean sticks. And this is garlic flavor. I love anything garlic, so I thought to grab these. Yeah, it's corn nuts. They're corn nuts. They're corn nuts. Right? Yeah, I don't like them. They're spicy a little. Just like peanuts. I don't know how about like Japanese nuts. I don't know how I feel about these. These are kind of oh, I hate peanuts. Like, I wish they were they're good, but I wish they were salty. It's kind of like bread. Like the wow, you they're interrupting the video. Uh, nah, I'm not a fan of these. No, these should say like nuts. These are by Frito Lay's. Double these, nuts. These are organic. It's like a peanut inside of like a shell. This is weird. Well, I know peanuts come inside the shell. You know what I mean. Oh, I like them. Mm. You like them? You would. Awesome. You could keep that whole bag. These are mad good. Don't listen. These are good as hell. I like them. They like those them. are not as bad as those. They have a nice crunch to them. So this right here is Caribas. You got original. So you got shit. You got shit. Nah, I'm not a fan of these either. They come with, they, they taste like bread almost. These are so good. Like stale bread. You smack. Mmm. You smack, smack. Mad good, like one out of ten. Like a ten. These are yuca? Yeah, they're chips. nice and salty, they're nice and thin. I'm Crunchy. obsessed. Guys, I am obsessed with this. Are you serious? What do you call the Migas gang? Migas gang. Migas freaking gang. These are bomb. Like, imagine wow, like a. These delivery people are on the road. They're making their money. Huh. Imagine. Uh, a nut in a shell. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, low key. Wow. Not in a shell. Low key, this shit tastes like a fart. Like what? at the beginning, but an aftertaste. Like don't you hear when people are like, oh, you know what a fart tastes like? No, and people in the comments don't start. No. Yo, y'all niggas be smelling your own smell, farts. No, when you smell something, you can almost taste Yo, it. Yo, quick question, side note. Do y'all like the smell of your own farts? I don't I like it, but I don't mind it. Like, I don't care. Nah, be looking for that. Nah, nah, nah. nah. Like, should be hitting like. Smoke. Should be like yo, like the nastier it smells, like the more proud of the, like, yourself you are, kinda. Like, damn, man, like, that shit came out of me. You know what? Hell yeah. <laughs> I know that everybody's first things. I know my first things, and I drive okay, my. Boyfriend. I am not the spotlight right now. I drive my boyfriend crazy. Please, I have people here that watch me for real. Yeah, Ooh. I know exactly. Yeah, so you're gonna start talking shit this about this me. This is what they gonna. This is what they wanna know. What my sister just farts. <laughs> Everybody knows when she farts. Let's just put it with this. Whatever. She got a distinct, distinct fart smell. That smell is straight rotten beans. Uh. I'm just sister, what else am I supposed to do? Embarrass you. You embarrass me all the time. You, you, gotta, you know what? This this not, this no, just say it. Yeah, Let me oh try it on. These taste like just regular corn. These taste like pure corn juca. Corn. Like pure juca. Like, like, Those are good. Like the bananas. The yeah, these are these are regular. Those mm -hmm. this mm -hmm. I like how they're not extra hard like those back home. Yeah. Have we tried oh, everything? Yeah, oh, I have a hand over here to hold it. We, so we tried all the chips. Oh no, we didn't try those chips. Oh no, no, these are so good. This might be my favorite chip so far. I like nah, them. the Yuka chips, like, but like, do they have like a weird, tea, like a weird, like first taste to you or no? No. Yeah, I like the mofongos because so it has a mix of juca, chicharron, and plata. These are so good. Oh my god. This is plata. Oh, this is just platinum chips? Oh, yeah. no, these are always smacked. Especially smack. when you're starving. Yeah, these are I had these mofongo chips and I was starving. Yo. Oh, but these are like a lot thinner though. Mm -hmm. I like my these. Yeah, the thinner the better. I like these because these are a couple of big. In each and they're nice and salty. Yeah, these are not that salty, but it's okay. Yeah. This is good. Let me try those. Platinum chips. Caribas. I thought it's cool to go to another country and see what they their junk food they for. Although I feel like their junk food is mad healthy. Right? Everybody be looking at us that you got ten minutes. That's the most popular chips here. Um, these are the pure black ones. Okay, I'm about to drink. Alright, I'm gonna try these cookies nuts. I'm gonna try the 
I um like you know guys you guys know like the sponge is it the SpongeBob ones right the SpongeBob ones right? you know the Krabby Patties oh, yeah. the little Krabby Patties these are like kind of like Krabby Patties but like a different cartoon I guess I don't know and I love them especially the little hot dog ones comment down below you guys mess with these right? we came in the spring doesn't matter oh I'm not blocking it if you um <laughs> like those like this video and comment down below but I'm gonna try them because they're my favorite. You know what I want some chinora juice, guys. Chinora juice <coughs> is the best thing in DR, please. It's the best thing invented. When I'm in DR or when I'm anywhere, I prefer These chinora. These cookies are not bad. With everything. Passion fruit juice. If you don't know what chinora is, oh, yeah. Other countries say it differently. Maricilla. Mari. Yep. Is it maracuja or oh, whatever? Maracuja, pacha, whatever, but it's good and I can't oh, open it. Oh, This is a go. Like a generic Chips Ahoy Chips. Oh, look. Oh, yeah. They seal it. See, that's what I like. I don't know if you guys can see, but they seal it from top to bottom. Like, right, right. This is just 10 cents. I wonder, we don't, guys, we spent like, it's 60 dollars. Six, how much was it? Like, 2,000 dollars. 2,000 pesos. Well, almost 3,000, excuse me, pesos. We bought more stuff, but... Mmm. This tastes similar. Not the exact same, but it's pretty much the same. Mmm-mm. Yeah, good. I have a cut in my mouth. So my favorite hard. part is like the little buns. Thank you. With the clutch. Passion fruit juice. Not the Welsh, not the Welsh ones either. Try these, these that work. These are all the little sandwiches. It's hard to make young. It hurts. Oh my god. It's amazing. Now we're getting it too. So if, if God was to tell me, listen, you can only have one drink for the rest of your life, it'd be this. And this is not without well, watches? Chino right? juice. No, yeah, yeah it's, it's not, not watches. Yeah, it's, it's not, not watches. watches. Passion fruit. Because the watches one has um, grapes. Grapes and shit in it. It's good too, but oh, it's for real, it does? Mm -hmm. yeah, I didn't know that. It's right on the carton. Oh, sure. I'm sure. Mm -hmm. How my mouth hurts? You guys fuck with these? I love them. Don't eat too much because I want the rest. Yeah, it's not. There's, a few things, the there's a few things that I don't want you guys to touch again. The freaking Duga chips. Who's that? I, mean, I want more. Those are mine. I want more. She ain't getting no more. You Maybe can one. definitely keep those double nut chips. Though. You can have them. Yeah, those are all those are definitely yours. It's so good. Nasty. 1000%. They're probably mad healthy for you too. What I don't want. I don't know. There's more stuff there that we haven't tried. Yeah. The shit in the front, isn't it? Let's go try this last for the scum. That's gum? Yeah, this is gum. Well, I think it's gum. Bob Bobaloo. That doesn't mean gum. Yo, to all my Dominicans out there, do you guys remember the gum that was squared and it was double bubble? It was squared. Yo, I see it. Oh, the ones that come with the tattoo? No. No. Oh, oh, that the the ones with the oh, the bazookas. No, I'm talking about from here. They were like the double bubble pink gums. I guess they don't make them anymore. Not the ones that you squeeze out and a little jelly comes out. The little squared, tough, hard ones. I saved them, I swear I did. I know, Yo, they're so good. They had a distinct taste that, like, even right the smell in them, yes, but the pink ones. Let even this, that was like a foil pink oh. one. Like, they gave me a taste of DR for some reason, and now they don't make them anymore. Yeah, I'm, this, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not into chocolate chips because these are good. You this one? I did. How was it? Good, right? Oh, these look not, um, these look like grandma chips. I mean, Ew. grandma cookies. I'm not really a cookie person. I don't know, like. I really don't fuck with these. They really kind of taste old, no bullshit. Ew. Yeah, yo. Yeah. Nah, this got a filling. These do? Even worse. You no know, damn filling. These ain't bad. You know what I noticed about the R2? The chocolate don't taste like that, like, as. I don't want to say that good. It tastes like freaking. It tastes like it's mixed with something. It's not like pure chocolate. Oh, oh no, I shouldn't eat pure chocolate. We did go um, boogie riding. Oh, they good. Do you want this one? Uh, they, we went boogie riding and they made us like a like an organic hot chocolate. That's the be best hot chocolate I've ever had in my life. We bought two of them shits. Two things like this. Yeah, you guys did. just bought hot chocolate that's in a coffee. And, and coffee. coffee. Oh. Just one though. Coffee. So, oh, these taste like Skittles. Are they gum or not? Yeah, blue ones? Yeah, They're not gum? I don't even want to try them. You're cheating. Like you're not trying shit. Guys, I'm not oh, a fan. I'm not a fan of candy. Like For real? Oh no, those not. Oh, they taste like. I love anything sweet. 
fuck with her. I'm, just, I'm all set. For real? Damn. Oh, I'm like, I hate that. I guess it's a mine. You're going to eat that? Just shoot it. No, I said these are Oh, that's what I say. Like, so, so far, <laughs> honestly, what I did, this is bootleg fugues. Bootleg fugues. The Cheetos ain't bad. I fuck with them. The Cheetos are good. They're nice and like fluffy. They're not they're not like a hard crunch that breaks your teeth. Um, I fuck with these. They like the bootleg ones that I buy back home because I never buy the real brand. Right, but this is like the bootleg ones, but these are the real brand, which is like, weird, right? I don't know. But those are not too crazy, man. Well, Fogo chips are probably my favorite snack. Yeah, this shit is banging. Um, this is a hell of a fuck no. Waste of money. Um, this tastes like that, uh, you know what this tastes like? That the Red Mountain Dew. If you guys ever had the Red Mountain Dew, that's what it tastes like. I ain't never had Red Mountain Dew. I never yeah. even know that I existed. Yeah, hell yeah. And the cotton ball told us that it was, um... <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? I don't know what I'm saying. The cotton ball. Kaleen. Shout out to you, cotton ball. Kaleen is the guy that was with us. Oh, shit. <laughs> that's your uncle. I heard him. That's your boy. He was just the He was just Kaleen. Damn. My bad. Yeah. And he was like right next to me. I know. <laughs> I said to I thought to myself, maybe he got a similar name or something. His name's not even close to Kali. I thought I was the only one that got that. It's like Jose or something. Damn, but yeah, damn. So y'all got that, y'all didn't even tell me. Damn. I caught it, but it happens too fast. It just happened too fast. I said, whatever. He goes, Kali. Kali wasn't necessarily that close to you. He was next to you, kind of, but like it was enough for you to. But he didn't say that either, though. No, he was just looking up. Oh, he looked up? Oh. <laughs> oh my bad. Um, yeah, we've been riding around with this guy that's like a know it all. He's so annoying. Yo, we've been a lot with a not a lot of know it alls and bad energy ass people in this trip, but it's for um, for um, it's hot. Let's talk a little bit before this video it's about the resorts. How did you what from one to ten when do you guys rate the resort? Like a six. Which one? Well, we went to. We'll get to that later. Okay, so the one that we stayed at. Yeah. So the I said the, the beach Republic. is nice. Yeah, the real Republica, Rio, or Rio, however they say, Rio, Rio, Rio Republic. Republica. Yep, from the Dominican Republic. We went. To, that's the one. I only went to one because they went to a wedding, and they went to two. So I went to one, and I give it like a six, six seven, because it's like, no, yeah, like a, overall. Okay, so what do you what do you, what do you think about the room? <laughs> the room is it's cheap. We had ocean view. Even though the ocean was kind of far, obviously it's not their fault. Um, the room was straight. I wasn't mad at it. Yeah. What about you? The AC is on blast. That shit was good. Yeah. I like that. I like that it has a lot of lighting. It was lights everywhere. Oh yeah, the lights everywhere. Switches everywhere. Lights everywhere. Yeah, but the but the plugs are oh, not the it. the plugs, yeah. The plugs is not it. They I had to build it. some like shit to like for the plugs to stay inside. Yeah. I think another thing that's cool is that it comes with like a a free mini bar. Oh yeah. You just free free liquor. Yeah. They refill the bottles every two days. They give you free champagne bottles as much as you want, so that's cool. But keyword, cheap. Watered cheap, down to cheap. The, the liquor. I really did really like one down. drink there. The I drinks were terrible. The alcoholic beverages zero percent were terrible. The orange juice was terrible. Yo, we literally only thing that was good was the champagne and the water. Yeah, basically, we like our first day there. We sat at the bar. We were literally drinking. All day, and then I didn't get drunk. I Nobody didn't get got drunk. drunk. I know, but then like buzz. we got the worst hangover. Yeah, I was gonna say that. How weird is it that you don't get drunk or even buzzed, and then you, you wake, wake up, up with a hangover? Yeah. I woke up with nothing, no kind buzz, no nothing, right? no nothing, nothing. I just had nothing. I didn't even feel nice, not once, nothing. And then the food gets repetitive. It wasn't like 100 percent bad, but it wasn't that good either. Yeah, they only have maybe like what. The buffet and then like two other restaurants. That we didn't even get to attend because they closed so damn yeah, early. They yeah, they early. And you had to put like your name on a list. So Me and Chris went to the Hard Rock for a day. We got a day pass. The Hard Rock is extremely expensive. So we decided to only get a day pass. To Zoo. It was his cousin's wedding. But yo, hey, guys. You guys are already going to a resort. Save your money and go to the Hard Rock if you're going to go to the resort. That is so right. worth it. The rooms are gorgeous. The scenery is bomb. The beach is bomb. The drinks is premium, premium liquor. Drinks, so free honey, free patron. They free open it right in your face everything. and they make it's you the rock. best drinks and it's all like not watered down. Like all the so it's bomb. So shout out to the hard rock. Yeah, next time we come, we're definitely gonna save up to head there. Like it's it's like I said, like it's pretty expensive, but it's definitely it's worth it. You might as well. And you can bump into celebrities there because there, oh, yeah. there was some award shows of the day before you guys were so you guys didn't get to see him but we didn't get to see them by his cousins again. Yeah. yeah my and it was Carol G, Anuel, El Alfa. All the problems were uh, uh, J Balvin. Yeah. A whole uh, bunch of them. A whole bunch of them. And it was dope. Yeah. 
A bunch of people there. Mozart, Abada was there. Everybody. All the so if you want to catch some celebrities, go on the weekend real quick. They <laughs> might be there. Yeah. yeah. So what else? Oh, and I definitely suggest going on the weekend. Not during the weekdays. Because there was like no activities going and on. And the music for our resort was trash. Everything was just whack in our resort, to be honest. Like, no offense, but like, I go to another country to have the other country's tradition, not to go listen to more American music. Yeah. I, we, they, were listening, they were playing Rihanna, we found love in a hopeless place. Like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. like, yeah. like, came out like 2010, didn't that shit? And the hallways, I don't know if, I don't want to say that the real is dirty, because they are just dirty people in general that leave plates everywhere, but it's just. Like, I don't know. Yeah, we didn't, see that. we didn't see that at the Hard Rock. Like, yeah. whatever, the Hard Rock was clean and impeccable. All the time. Impeccable like, at all the time. Amazing, amazing. But the beach was beautiful. Yeah, the beach was beautiful. Like, they share the same beach, so the beach is probably. Airbnbs in Punta Cana are really dope and really cheap, so that's, really, that's a good option to look at if you guys want to come to DR. So that's cool. Just be careful. Yeah, just be careful. Yeah. What else? I'm sorry. Uh, probably one more comment for me about the whole DR experience is guys. The capital, Santo Domingo. Shit. The traffic. There is no such thing as lanes. There is no such thing as traffic lights. There is no traffic. such thing as stop signs. No. Traffic signs. And if there is, they don't follow it. Yeah. The driver that was driving us today, he literally just ate the light. Like yeah, he wouldn't stop at stop There's signs. There's kids, babies, infants, infants. on freaking motorcycles. No more. No helmets. No helmets. No, no helmets. Helmet. They just held on by their mom right here. It's like like this. And, and no strap, no to us it's shocking because we don't see that in the states but for them that's just a hustle every day. that's just what they do yeah they, told, they told us that like on school days there'd be like five six kids on one motorcycle yeah. just getting to get into like the school so we're not criticizing but it's just a shock it's, yeah it's like a culture it's shock you know what i mean we're not used to that like if we was to do that in the u.s you already know we're, oh, we're, gonna jail. we're all getting locked up they're taking the kids and Woo! they're taking the kids throwing it out yep. but as you guys know i'm gonna be I'm, i've been vlogging not all day but I, i'm definitely gonna vlog some up some of the trip so you guys will see some of the stuff yeah. um, do you guys have anything else here no, um, i'm excited i definitely next time i want to come i want to come with more friends like younger like you know Hell keep, fucking people yeah. around people that already people. have kind of like an idea of around the city you know people, yeah so like, that we could do like 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 hood things yeah, hood rat things yeah because we can <laughs> hood rat things with our friends that's what we're trying i just to want to do, do yeah. more traditional <laughs> stuff like sit in the freaking corner store and listen to loud music yeah yeah and she get a beer, yeah. We don't get that. We haven't got to, we haven't, we're we'll probably not gonna be able to get to that. Yeah. But. Cause it's like really sketchy too, like, like I said, like you have to really know yeah. And it's any way you go in the world, if you don't know like what parts of the hoods you're going exactly. to like Or you can't, you can't just go into any hood, cause that's just yeah. how it works And we're, we, they can tell we're Americans from Yeah, I try to yeah, dress yeah. as basic yeah. as yeah. possible, as, as you can see As much shirt, as you try to blend some in, biker you shorts, know, you And know. still, and, and not only that, but we, I kind of forget that People don't know what excuse me means here And <laughs> so you know, excuse me, thank you, you're welcome, we'll say stuff like that And they'll be like, yeah, they're gonna like hmm. Everybody's looking at you like from head to toe, everybody, everybody, men, women, every, kids. Yo, I didn't tell you guys, but I was in my mom's cousin's area. This is a little kid that's like five, buying stuff for his parents in the corner store. He passes by and goes to me. And I'm like, oh my god. And I'm like, the, I'm like, am I bugging? And I tell the primo, am I bugging? And he started laughing and goes, no, you're not bugging. All right. I continue on my phone. He passes by again and goes, and I'm like, the fuck is wrong with this little boy? <laughs> he passes by again. So yeah, guys, I think I left off with the little boy. Um, the camera died, but I left off with the little boy. Um, trying to wink at me. So the point of the matter is that he came three times around and he winked at me, and I told him something the third time. I said, "Mira, muchachito fresco." He goes, "Me gusta tú." And I just didn't even know what to say. He just kept walking. Shit like that. How long did you say he was? Like five. So that means he was like twenty-five. And he the card in. Yep, and he said it. And he said it just like that. Me gusta tú. No, I would have been like, oh, you got a job to maintain me? And yeah. he was like doing errands at five, like kindergarten. That's crazy. Yeah. My baby. But yeah, guys, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please be sure to comment, like, share, and subscribe, and we will see you guys next time. Oh, mm -hmm. and subscribe to my channel, Jenny D. G I N N Y D E E E. Wow. Yep. I'll go just link the, link the page down below. Yeah. <laughs> Free promo. Free promo. Guys, I don't, I, I'm, I don't know if I'm going to get into YouTube yet, but just in case I do. You have a couple videos. Subscribe. Oh yeah, I do. Well, I do. Tomorrow I'm gonna be doing the um, the what is it again? Speaking only English in the Dominican Republic. This is gonna be crazy. Ooh. We should all do it. We should. All right, we should. We'll do it. Yeah, we'll so do it. we're gonna do this video tomorrow when we wake up. Um, obviously not when we wake up, but when we go out. 
So stay tuned and watch that video because it's about to be fucking hilarious. Because no people here got no shame. They're gonna cuss <laughs> us out and they're gonna fucking finesse us. But bye guys. Peace. I want like this. <laughs> <laughs>